Hello and welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question which says How many terms of the AP minus 6 minus 11 upon 2 minus 5 are needed to give the sum minus 25? Let us now begin with the solution. The given AP is minus 6, minus 11 upon 2, minus 5 and so on. And here the first term is equal to minus 6 and the common difference is equal to minus 11 upon 2 minus of minus 6 which is equal to minus 11 upon 2 plus 6 which is 1 upon 2. Now let n terms of the given AP gives the sum Minus 25. That is, Sn is equal to minus 25. Now the formula of Sn is n upon 2 into 2a plus n minus 1 into d. This is equal to minus 25. Or n upon 2, 2, and a is minus 6 plus n minus 1 into d is half. This is equal to minus 25. Or n upon 2 into minus 12 plus n upon 2 minus half is equal to minus 25. Or we have n upon 2 into n upon 2 minus 25 upon 2 is equal to minus 25 or n upon 4 into n minus 25 is equal to minus 25 or we can say that further n square minus 25 n is equal to minus 100 on cross multiplying and opening the brackets or n square minus 25 n plus 100 is equal to 0. Now, by splitting the middle term, this expression can further be written as n square minus 20n minus 5n plus 100 is equal to 0. Now, taking n common from the first two terms and minus 5 common from the last two terms, we have n into n minus 20 minus 5 into n minus 20. Or n minus 20 into n minus 5 is equal to 0. Here also we have 0. Sorry. Now, if the product of two numbers is equal to 0, then at least one of them is 0. This implies either n minus 20 is equal to 0 or n minus 5 is equal to 0. This implies n is equal to 5 or 20. Both the values of n give the required sum. Hence, our answer is the value of n is 5 or 20. So, this completes the session. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care and have a good day.